can sacrifice your health to your allies, but you can use up the health you drained. I don't want to punish people like that because then they would just never heal allies. You're saying people are innately greedy. Servants. Oh, they got fortified armor for some reason. They make loads of money, don't they? But yeah, what I'm taking away from this is that there's a guy drilling above me. I better head off in a few seconds. What I'm taking away from this is maybe don't do time shops. Um, add in um, some like uh, mini bosses in the explorable areas to make it less like a not so much a bunch of nook, nooks and crannies, but like a large area and you have this chance to take on. Maybe... Maybe I should just... Do you like dislike the idea of the gold coin? Like people want their own lanes, but it's, I mean you can share your lane with someone else, but... The fact that it's like one gold coin dropping and there's two players who probably both... What determines the gold dropping? It's just one of the uh, mobs in the wave to up the coin. Hmm. One of the mobs in the wave, so any mob, or...? No, it's, um... Out with it. Like, if it was three militia and a footman, it's always the footman. It's always the last one spawned. Which, in, in that situation, is the footman or the rifleman. I think I'm gonna get pretty annoyed if I don't pick up the gold coin before someone else does. Yeah, it's the thing, if you're, like, in a lane two people who cannot share in any way. It's tricky. Then I also don't want it to be a uh, bounty. Because in that case, well, you'll have people competing to try to last it. It's kind of fun though. But I do get that. Maybe you could have something that is like most gold is shared, but I don't know. How do you do that? Sort of like beating I mean, other people to get in the gold is fun. Think but the map you're trying to design like is definitely way more. I mean, I mean, team you're going to be like focused. max two, two people in the lane. So you're going to have that one person to sort of negotiate with, unless there's someone literally just running around lanes trying to steal gold. But I mean, if, if it's that bad, if people are that eager to try to mess with each other, then there's just not going to be cooperation to the point you can beat the map anyway. Yeah. I feel like having that competition with like just a one player might be okay, but maybe I should move away the goal from the coin. It's, a, it's giving 250 right now, maybe if it gives like 100, and you got the other 150 guaranteed each time. I could just up your passive gold generation, you know? But... Yeah, it's it's interesting. Like which way you want to go with it. I suppose you got to sort of like go quite heavy though. Like you say, you're trying to make it more of a team one, so it's going to be less about greed. But then will people? Yeah. I mean, people I, like I their greed. To, I want to allow both playstyles essentially. You know? I want to make it, you know, make heroes that people can can play and be like. The only three people I care about are I, me, and myself, you know? That's right. You'll notice, like, say, in the Oak Omega, you know, he, you could he, you could bloodlust an ally, or you could just never do that. If you want to. Yeah, that's true. But there are certain heroes that are just better suited to supporting. Supporting others, yeah. Definitely. So I need to think about that gold coin. Dennis does not approve of it at all. Poor Dennis. You might just be better off having the creeps just like give gold naturally. What if I do like both? So there's like a coin. Yeah. Like, a bit so half and half, thing, like, right? So the one thing is... Um, I just left you again. CPA, okay. Well, Synchro pieced out. Nice guy. But I, I, you know, I don't want that. Let's say that you're like going top lane or whatever. 
and you have um i don't know let, let's say random there and he's like i'm gonna be your sin daddy willy i'm gonna i'm gonna heal you and all that stuff and help yeah. you kill the waves and then he's like oh shit, i stole the kills with my big chain lightning you know, you know I, don't, I don't want people to like worry about that when they're well, it seems like you kind of know what you want, then, really. Yeah. I can't just make the map overclocked. Just make the map? I mean, you, you just made BHS, and we know how that fucking ended. Fantastically. Yeah, and I don't make fantastic maps. I make trash maps. In this version, it doesn't look like you build anything. The slave master is just what he is. More gold is required. We would do normal Legion TD, but no one joins them anymore. So I'm in a position of joining other people's Legion TDs and seeing what happens. Just everyone Random hates Legion TD just now. Just Damn, these imps have got fast regeneration. Yeah, I'll head off. Alrighty. Thank you for testing the map. Soraya, you're welcome. How's Nick? Peacing out. <laughs> you can try that map another time, Stylo. I guess we're not saving for level 4 then. Pride Stalker's peaced out. Guess that makes it a free versus free. They have got a lot leaked on that side though. Thought these guys are going to be pros. We'll have to try and get like one Legion TD game tomorrow. That king's fucked. I think it's just a race to see how much lumber you can push now. First one to 11, 11, uh, no, sorry, 9 4 wins. <laughs> I won 10 2. So when you upgrade lumber, it upgrades a wisp as well, I'll say. Yeah, it played pretty smoothly for Reforge at least, but obviously you'd have eight players in the game and they'd all be using abilities and stuff and three more weight lanes, uh, that would definitely slow it down. I think it is an odd choice to force Reforge though. Pretty sure everyone would prefer to play without it. Nick just hates everyone. So this one doesn't actually have like PR mode where the towers are changing each level. Enlighten me, that's a given. For my brothers. Some of the hero models don't appear.
they all got fired, yeah. Well, it is what it is. But I think making it reforged, forced reforged, like Blizzard style, probably won't be too popular. Feels like I've got Farseers betraying me. They're just ignoring my Farseers. I'm attacking everything else. It's kind of BS because my Farseers have fortified armor. I don't think I sent, did I? This fortified armor is a bit OP. Get that greed. Never thought there would be too many pigs, but there have been. Stop being positive, it says fire alarm. Damn with positivity. Like my fortified armor. Job's done. Surprised they still got two players in the game here, especially with those leaks. Try to pick them off on level seven. and damage is sweet. Uh, at least the uh, s these guys are tanking it now. I think I'm still going down there. Yeah, I'm not going to kill this. I'm going to take way too much damage. They kind of don't tank, actually. They sort of seem to tank, but then they don't. So they're not quite as good as they seem. <laughs> but they are, they are, they've got OP stats, they've got like fortified armor. Okay. Upgrade complete. Job's done. 
No, I think this was just, yeah, in the tournament. Just some mobs have this kind of weird thing where they don't get attacked. Yeah, they could accidentally be buildings, like Fire Alarm says. Classified as buildings. AOE death and decay. That's so OP, that ghost ability. Strain health. Like the amount of damage he must do. Off we go. Making easy work at level seven. Maybe I spoke too soon. Well, it looked like I made easy work of it. I almost did. But I can't... Don't, no, actually, my Slave Masters are still alive. We're okay. Yeah, they're just going to keep on going. I can't believe we didn't actually kill him. Didn't even get close. I guess wait till 10 then. To get mass necrolites actually for level 10. I think they have um, light armor. I'll just save my lumber for 10.
There's meat wagon upgrades to plague speeder. I don't know. It might do in this version. I need some big old AoE damage right here. Got a war machine. Does significantly more damage than the uh, meat wagon. Better range as well. They got a tactical leak. Tactical champion. Absolutely blasted. I'm all in on the uh, Necrolite. Completely overkilling it. Level 10 should be very easy. Doesn't look like there's an upgrade for War Machine. What are you doing yeah, I'll challenge the champion. Feeling confident. To the terrorist organization that suddenly redeemed itself out of nowhere, cheers. Yeah, I magically just decided to stop being a terrorist organization. Thank you. My focus fire should be pretty damn good then. Can you challenge um, a champion on level 10? Because that seems very dangerous to do that. Also, we can send. I don't know if you have to wait till it requires level 10, so it might be worth waiting till level 10 and then just send off the big boys. Like as quick as you can. It's weird because you can't send a behemoth now. Or these. But you could send these in earlier levels. Where's that champion? I lost track of him. Oh well. Nice. Resummon. I'll just wait till 10 then before sending. I'm gonna spam this. I'm gonna spam like all of this, all the hotkeys for this and send the strongest stuff. Get ready to spam, boys. Get ready. Oh, it changes. That's dangerous. Oh, melting it. Absolutely melting it. It's 
so much pierce. Not even close. That's right, boys. I got this. You know, the annoying thing is, is they've got zero weight leaks on the left-hand side. So, yeah. It doesn't seem very easy to kill the enemy team. I guess I'll just go back to Mass Hades now, because I don't want to go too... I only went crazy on the Pierce, because I thought it'd be funny first as level 10. And it is. It is exactly what I thought it would be. Big boys. Well, like, Kraken. Like, how many big boys? Oh, you just thinking Commander. I'm actually going to leak here, so we might want to upgrade the King anyway. I mean, I did kill a lot of them, to be fair, so it's pretty good going. I actually, I still got those guys left. They might take out one more. Nope, never mind. They failed. Does he have a base ability? Like Shockwave or something, didn't he? Ah, did it without even losing a life. Nailed it. I, I, I don't know. I feel like just getting a hero now. I think I'm just going to get a hero. I don't, I don't know this map very well, but... I feel like we've gone long enough now. Maybe Princess of the Moon. She gets like an aura. Priestess of the Poon. Can't upgrade her again, unfortunately. I'll upgrade those two. Get one more of these. That needs 100. Oh, I thought it was 140, actually. Oh, look at them. They're marching on. So we've got two turtles to fight against here. Uh, they have got a bit of a push. Almost the same as us. Almost. As long as we stay ahead of them, we should be okay, though. There's Zeus, though. I don't think we're going to win this. What? That demon was a coward. We got 10 10 to 10 10, and then there's a 10 5, and we got 10 8 10 9, so we're on good, we're in a good point. The value, they have a bit more value than we do, though. I agree. You're gonna lead the charge, Missy. You're going to lead the charge. Send level 12. Could try. I mean, who knows at this point. There's some rogue kraken for some reason. I don't know when this guy becomes available again. Because it says requires level 10. But we're past level 10. Range is normally key on this map. Because it's just like the mobs can't even reach you most of the time. If you do have mobs in... If you have your units close to them, they will attack you though. So you want to take advantage of the fact that they don't even move. And snipe them down as quickly as possible. What have we got? Shaman and Gargs? Sure, why not? Send a couple of warlocks. Not that we're going to 
get far. Maybe the slave dudes, um, they have a reduced chance to be focused because they can make even more money. But that's kind of OP. Trust in my command. I trust my queen. Upgrade complete. Ooh, she's fully upgraded. Out with it. Already. We well, there you go. I'll start getting these bad boys again then. Upgrade complete. Heck, I'm almost tempted to send a behemoth. I'm gonna do it because I want to. More lumber is required. That's uh, quite a lot of uh, lumber pumping. I'll go for the blister instead of the chariot because I think I'm gonna get it. Let's kill them this time, boys. Let's finish this off. Really expensive to upgrade. Twelve to fourteen, sixteen to seventeen. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they send and just kill us at some point. We haven't been able to kill them so far. I guess we didn't kill him. Enlighten me. No one shall be the wiser. <laughs> Just seeing how far I can push. Does the shadow will research complete? It just keeps going. I am prepared for my brothers. Say the, the word shall serve. I am vigilant. You damn straight. I'm gonna go again. It's only a 12% aura bonus, actually. I'm pretty sure there's like units that give better aura damage than that. I'm sure this is therapeutic for someone. It takes them that long before they start to move past the slave masters and go into these units that are way more vulnerable. Next level I probably won't be so fortunate, but this level I felt confident with the amount of piercing damage I have. 
I don't feel like I've got anything good first. It's level 14 though. Might be time for a reroll. See, I'm gonna get the flying machine aura now. I'll just get minotaurs or so. Yeah, you get a better bonus from this. Bring it on! Bring it on! Twenty-four percent damage bonus, plus the true shot aura. That's actually not bad. That's thirty-six percent extra damage for my range units, and like almost all of my units are ranged. It's pretty good re-roll, yeah, because I just keep building those guys. Plus, obviously, that ore is nice. They decided to send. I don't know the gyros stack in this version. In the other version, they don't. Like a big one and a small one. Yeah, you could just try to re-roll again and see if you get captains or more auras. Probably be worth spending for it. Because the amount of units I've got now. So I'm not sure when we plan to send. Maybe when the demon becomes available. Which should be like 15 onwards, shouldn't it? So we can make a decision then. They're starting to break through my ranks. All of my skeletons dissipated. It's game over for me. I got 4,000 lumber. You guys have actually got that as well. I suppose I spent a bunch of lumber just upgrading the lumber. Because it costs like 350 lumber a a time in like 400 gold, 450 gold, 500 gold. Right, we need a way to kill them in one fell swoop. Because we actually just can't seem to kill them. Getting tanky boys. I'll see if the aura does stack, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't. We are poised to strike. Job's done. Wait, that's the wrong one. Nah. What does the shadow doesn't look like it? Done. I'll re-roll next turn or something. We can send Demon now, by the way. I pledge my loyalty. And then maybe Gargs and Shaman or so. Storm, Earth, and Fire. Heed my call. Storm, Earth, and Fire. Bet we still don't even get close to killing them, though. Dunno, actually, maybe, because next level is going to be ranged. And those could be quite nasty. Uh, not going to be able to get another demon. Uh, no chance. Let's re-roll. 
Oh, we got a heal. But we don't have any other aura. Might get the Disciple for the mana one. Not that I think that's going to work on a lot of those units, but... Okay, Apparition. That's a debuff for the enemy. Don't think I'm going to afford to upgrade it there. Also, don't forget to send some stuff. Just in time. That'll do, pig. I mean, their masseuse is just still so good, though, isn't it? It's really weird how the 3.45 version isn't really ever seen. Like, when I look at the custom games list, you don't really see it. That's why this. That's why I joined this one. Seven point zero is out for Legion. What do you mean? Seven point zero. We still got more alive on our side. I know there's more of us, but still, like eighty. If they die and they've got leaked eighty, we might stand a chance. But it looks like it almost. We might have this then. These masters still getting a few kills. This is it, Luigi. He's pretty buff, that king. There's no demons or anything, so... Jeez. This is crazy. I don't know. We can up our king, but I still feel like just saving lumber just to kill them. Yeah, I don't know, I'll try a demon or something. Or try 18 or something then. Save and go 18. I don't know. Running out of ideas, boys. Get a couple of fortified tanks on the outside. It's kind of nice, actually, to be fair. <laughs> 10k lumber. Well, my brothers. I mean, uh, seems done. it. Yeah, sure. I'll get there quicker than you guys, eh? <laughs> we even have time to spend 10k lumber. Oh, they sent some big stuff. Might have to upgrade the king. We'll see. It's 
Darth Sidious on this side. Poseidon over here. I feel like this is the part where they're going to start fighting, fighting back. But it takes a long time. I have got so many units though, I'm not sure they can. I could focus that demon to be fair. On the mind, they did it anyway. Poseidon loses. Darth Sidious loses. I won't be able to clear all of that, so we might have to... Don't upgrade the king. I can upgrade the king. I got like an extra thousand, two thousand lumber. I'll see how bad we leak. Because I still got a lot of units left. Stay where you are. You bad boys. Priestess of the Moon is still going. Mm, I'll do a few king upgrades. So it does not look like I'm going to clear that by any means necessary. I don't want to go too crazy though, but I feel like maybe we do have to. There's, it's not that much, and we've got like four or five lives, so we don't have to go too crazy. We could even leak a life or two, and it's not going to matter. See how much damage. Yeah, we don't need to push anymore in the king. Don't. You just don't have to. Right, don't panic. Lose one life, if that. Does it matter? Even then, we won't lose a life. Oh, you're down to 2,000 lumber. Oof. Finish that off. <laughs> Out with it. That's a given. For my brothers. What's level twenty? That's heavy armor, isn't it? It's enchant what does extra damage to enchanted armor? Yes, hundred and twenty five percent magic does hundred and twenty five percent to enchanted. Let's see if we can find some magic. That's a bad reroll. Research complete. Oh man. These are bad rerolls. Has begun. Job's done. Research complete. Okay. New aura, but not the one we want. I ain't getting any magic damage, boys. Job's done. Job's done. I mean, priest, but it's not exactly what I would constitute as magic damage. It's more of a healer than it is like. I was looking for these things, Dark Priest Meridians. I'm sure I can probably play the latest version, but this is a map that was hosted on the custom games list, which I decided to join, so take it up with the guy that hosted the map, not me. That's for what the Legion TD version is. I know you guys love getting obsessed with the versions of maps. I can't even re-roll anymore. I don't think that should be like... You should be unable to re-roll anymore, because then you're literally just stuck with whatever you got at the end. I'd be better off with like Mass Lord of Deaths. I just got really unlucky with my re-rolls. I didn't even spend like a thousand gold this turn because of the re-roll business. Couldn't find anything I actually wanted. Tactical leak. Enlighten me has begun with my brothers. By bidding. Overseer gets magic damage when it's upgraded, but I wouldn't cons 
consider that being a great idea to mass them. It's literally the only unit that will get magic damage, though, from what I can build. I'll just get the tanks then, I guess. That's not ideal. That's a given. No one should be the wiser. That's a given. Dear oh dear. Dear oh dear. Oh, hello there. Job's done. You're all invisible. What ails you? I'm your suitor. More gold is required. Oh, Zeus is more. Can't quite afford it. All right. So wave summons have been sent, so we should be safe to just spam whatever we can. It's going to be ridiculous. I know. You can't get the big boys yet. I know we can't. We have to send those next turn. But I've still got 4,000 lumber, bloody hell. This is going to be 1,500, 2,500, 3,100, 4,000... Uh, sorry, 3,600. 4,200-ish. Yeah, so about 5k just to send all of those. So I'll save the lumber now. Plus we're going to have some time before the next level starts. Out with it. <sighs> I, it's, like, I can't reroll. I don't like these guys short range. I think they can almost be reached by the turtles. Yeah, you can't send until the level starts. This is ridiculous. Like the game needs to sort of end now. Be ready to spam with your advanced barracks. Be ready to click on it if it changes. There he goes. Go, go, go. It should be a tasty send. I feel like the best thing maybe is just Zeus. Because even though it's obviously more for the early game, we're in a... You know, the majority of waves go on for so long that they're going to do so much damage. Alright, the good news is, is they've got almost as, the same amount as leaked as we do. So I think the level has to end now. And we can pretty much finish up the kings soon-ish. If Overclocked does good king control. We should have stronger sends as well. We didn't do presents though. That's the only thing we haven't got that they might have. Which actually might mean that we lose. <laughs> God damn it. I don't know actually. They ain't got many heals left. That should be one more heal for them. 
Our king is going down super quick though. They've even got half the amount of mobs left on that side. This is BS, bro. This map is so jank. GG. This is such a jank map, man. Ah! We did still win it just about, but I felt like we were we were that close to losing. We were like that close to still losing that. <sighs> jank map. I was at 1017 and it was still a struggle to kill them. What on earth? There you go though. There's your Legion TD. It might not necessarily be the one that you want, but it's the one that you got. Tell that to my community at the twitch.tv slash witty. Whenever I host Legion TD, no one joins it anymore. So you get what you get. <laughs>